Hey guys, um, I'm doing the pet tag today, you can probably tell from the title or the dogs and one of them has just hidden herself off camera. I'm looking down because the questions are down here and she does not want to be seen. Okay, I've got my little girl and my little boy is asleep back there. She probably won't stay with me the whole time, but right. So if you don't know what the pet tag is, just like any other tag, you answer some questions. This time it's about your pets. Um, so I have nine questions, there's obviously different variations, but I'm doing this one. Okay, so what is your pet's name? Over here we have Pickles, he's a boy, and then the one trying to escape off my lap is Bunnin, and she's a girl. Oh, she hid my question. Why, why would you hide my questions? She, she tapped my iPod and I lost my questions. What kind of pet is it and what breed? They're both dogs, you can probably tell that. And they're Maltese cross Shih Tzus. Also, they're from the same litter. So, yeah. How long have you had your pet friend? Um, about a year, heading towards three months. How did you get your pet? Well, I was looking on trading posts. I wanted a dog for a while now. And, can you stay please, button? Baby girl. Oh, she doesn't want to stay, hold on. Where are you going? Oh, oh, and Pickles has looked up. Hey, Pickles. I, I was looking on the trading post, um, and I wanted multi Shih Tzu, adorable little white fluffy things. We were on our way to look at different ones, but we couldn't have them for another, I think it was two weeks. And then my mum found those and called us, and we went and saw them, and they were adorable. Um, I got Button on a Monday, and then... My brother fell in love with her because we are going to get two dogs and decided he wanted one so he went back and got pickles on the Thursday. How old is your pet? They're a year and five months old. I don't think we're getting Bun and back but we have pickles don't we? What are some quirky things about your pet's personality? Um, well, Pickles has a lot of spots around the house that he likes to sit mainly in the corner of one of our couches and if you sit there he will stare at you and stare at you and stare at you until you get up and he will jump in that spot. He'll like give you a death glare. But then she, she hides things. Um, one time I was in our study on the computer and she was in there and then she disappeared and I saw her backing out of the cupboard in there and she'd put a bone inside the cupboard so her brother wouldn't find it and she like looks around and she makes sure if um, he's there or not, if he can see her and she'll like, even if she's inside, she put something in the corner and try to bury it. Um, it's quite cute. What does your relationship with your pet mean to you? It means a lot. Um, they make me feel so happy when I'm down there come and cuddle me or play with me and um, I just love them. I'm really glad I have them. What are some of your favourite pastimes with your pets? Um, I like just cuddling with them mainly. I'm not exactly sporty but I don't mind running around with them occasionally. Um, they wear me out though. <laughs> what are the nicknames that you call your pet? I have a lot of nicknames. Um, for Pickles here, he's Senor Pickles, Mr. Pickles, um, my little boy, gorgeous boy, baby boy, you know, Pickolito sometimes. Button is Button Pie, gorgeous girl, baby girl, my little derp. And I have some nicknames for both of them. Sometimes I call them my snow dogs, like, I'm like my snow dogs my little critters or sometimes I call them monsters yeah they have lots of nicknames probably even more that just come out but yeah she was sitting by herself on the rug so I've brought her back so that is the end of my pet tag I'm going to tag my friends Karina and Ailish who both have dogs so anyway thanks for watching please thumbs up and comment below subscribe above all that kind of stuff and I will see you in my next video bye guys